Okay, well, time for one of the most fabulous dinners we're going to have of the year. Not even just this Florence trip of the year. This is the Mission Star, the Chic Nada. You make yourselves look more like. Do you know what I mean? No. Your shorts aren't even on straight. <laughs> Right here behind me in this beautiful vaulted piazza is the Bistro. I know it looks like a Michelin style restaurant, but this isn't it. Yeah, this is the warm up. <laughs> I don't have ever seen a kitchen like this. This is incredible. Yeah, let's do it. At the end of the red carpet is the restaurant, but just to the right is the bar. We're going to have a little pre dinner aperitivo because, you know, we really need that. Right, Negroni time, I think. Oh, I love Top Door. Oh, I love this is a Campari shaker and you saw Matteo just, just toying with us, you know? Ooh, oh my God, look at this. Oh, come on. It's oh. Negroni is a classic cocktail, gin, Campari, red vermouth. It was invented in Florence. It was actually created about 200 meters from where we are. This in a frozen glass with their stamped ice is their Negroni. Oh my God, I mean that. It's like drinking leather. So one of you boys asked for a margarita, a Tommy's margarita, a little chili on top. It's a little bit of a spicy Tommy's margarita. That is so good. So in this little teacup is Matteo's bye-bye drink, right? Not a Campari, but another bit is called a Select and obviously other things, but it is a beautiful drink, right? Your shorts are you rolled straight. Are you rolled straight. <laughs> we're, being, we're being summoned. Oh, okay, um, is this the most beautiful restaurant I've ever been in? Yes. That stuff up top, over 500 years old. Surprising. We start here from the sea bream and quinoa. Guys, I'm so happy I'm hungry. Honestly, it's a rarity to be on top jaw and be hungry. So this is the bonbon. The bonbon with a strawberry jelly inside. Scratch what I just said, it's not a strawberry jelly inside. <laughs> Cheers, dude. We're having scampi to start. Not probably scampi as we know it. You know? And with it, we're having a Pinot Bianco 2020 vintage. Ooh, Jesus. Really? That's maybe the best one, best wines I've ever had. Really? Yeah. This is langoustine and it's been served with the tomato water and basil oil. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, so good. What we have here is red money served with a pea risotto. Wow, the creaminess, the saltiness, the tart, the, oh. Okay, wake up in the morning, put a straw inside this bottle and start. <laughs> like a Capri Sun. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, I'm excited, oh God, I'm so excited for this. It's like pork with a super high fat content, but not so high that it tastes like that. That is absolutely gorgeous. This is stuffed with hazelnut cream. Oh my gosh. A little cappuccino, a little macchiato, just like in your mouth. Ice cream with a chocolate dusting. Oh my God. This is a dessert wine, absolute nectar. It's like drinking champagne as a bee, you know? Like when bees have housewarming. Does it make any sense? I mean, honestly, come to Florence and eat nothing but like Rice Krispies to save money and then come to Sheet and Honor, absorb it all and take it all in and be like, Ugh. and then just go back to your Rice Krispies for like a week. It's worth it. Food was fantastic. I was overwhelmed by stuff and beautiful wine and beautiful food and that unbelievable setting. I need to like slap myself back into reality, you know, like, 